FINRA is a self-regulatory organization responsible for oversight of securities firms doing business in the United States. Uh, our mission is investor protection and market integrity. We have a mix of different applications at FINRA. We have the big data, which is primarily on Hadoop-based systems today, as well as many uh, applications that run on top of relational databases. Uh, we are moving those to the cloud, specifically onto the RDS platform. So FINRA's relational database migration probably got started right at the tail end of its big data move. Uh, we began to start thinking about what that would look like and what platform we wanted to move on to. We made the decision to move on to RDS. And we also made the decision that the engine of choice for us was going to be Postgres. At this point where we're at is we've moved some of the applications that are um, built from the ground up are already in the cloud. Most of the applications at this point are in the early stages of dev and QC where they are experimenting with things like DMS and schema conversion tool to see what that migration is going to look like, starting to size the instance types that uh, they think they'll need and getting comfortable with both Postgres as well as with RDS itself. In total, FINRA will be moving approximately 100 to 200 relational databases to the cloud. We expect by mid-year, actually near the end of this year, we'll move that data staging hub in its initial implementation to the cloud. FINRA is very interested in the recent announcement of um, Aurora sorting Postgres SQL. We've been monitoring what the Aurora for MySQL has been able to do, and we are very interested in the capabilities that it offers. So for FINRA, the, the advantage of using AWS, and in particular RDS, has been the ability to turn control back to the uh, development teams to be able to spin up instances in the lower environments in particular to experiment and try new things versus having to go through a more heavyweight process of provisioning a new database instance. It allows us to, one, uh, troubleshoot issues more quickly by being able to spin up an instance, as well as to experiment with newer versions or perhaps even different uh, database technologies like Aurora.